What's up guys, got the headlight restoration kit we're gonna put into action right now. I wanna show you how to restore headlights. You don't wanna drive a car around like this, especially going into the winter time. It gets darker sooner now. So you wanna have your headlights nice and clear. As you can see, all the contamination, oxidation, all the rail dust, brake dust, industrial fallout, all the junk that accumulates on your headlights with the heat from the headlight as well and the sun hitting it, it creates a perfect storm for these, this haze. It's an awful haze that you don't want. So that way when you're on the road, it blocks you and keeps you from seeing clearly. So we're gonna clean them up. We're gonna use the headlight restoration kit that we have here in the store. And then we're gonna show you how it's done. Super easy. You can do multiple cars with this one restoration kit. We're gonna show you how it's done. What I'm gonna do right now is do a quick waterless wash. As you can see, this is sitting out here. We don't have a pressure washer with us. So I'm just gonna spray a little bit of the waterless wash just to get any kind of dust or debris off the paint, off the headlights. So that way when I do my work, I'm not scratching it more with any dirt or junk that is on there. So this will take off any kind of dirt as you can see, it's very dirty. And that will leave it nice and clean so that I can go ahead and restore my headlights. And I'm going to also tape off all the plastic and all this trim around so that when I do use my uh, wet sanding sheets, I don't scratch it all up. So this amazing headlight restoration kit has everything you need. You have the wet sanding sheets, you have the buffing pad, you have the device that goes onto your drill and you get the compound that you're going to go ahead and finalize that. We're going to show you how it's done right I am going to add tape on the edges here before I do those edges so that I don't scratch up the paint. Alright guys, so here we go. I have the 1000 grit sanding sheet because they're pretty bad as you can see I went straight to 1000 if your headlights not very foggy all you can you want to go with is 3000 grit so I'm going to wet the headlight right you want to wet your sanding sheet and go ahead and go to 10. it's that simple guys super easy 1000 grit I'm going to go ahead and wipe it off so as you can see it looks foggy it looks like I've scraped it off which is what I did. So what I'm gonna do now is switch to my 3000 grit. There's 3000 grit. And I'm gonna go back over the same area one more time, this time with 3000. Wet my headlight again, wet my wet sanding sheet. There we go, wipe it off again. As you can see already, you can see the difference between the part where I've done the wet sanding and the part where I have not. So right now it's a bit hazy, right? Because I need to come back with the finishing polish to clear it up. But that is, that's it guys, it is that simple. So now I'm gonna change my wet sanding sheet, take that off and put on my actual cutting pad. I'm ready to go. As soon as I put some of this compound on there. It is a brand new pad, so I'm gonna add a little extra because it is dry. You can use a little detail spray to prime the pad. There you go. Make sure you blot it on there so you don't have compound spreading all over the place. <laughs> Depending on the drill you are using with the high RPM, you will have some heat created on your headlight. So be careful not to use something that's high speed, like a high impact drill. If it's high speed, you wanna make sure you don't get it too hot. If you stay in one section, you will burn that plastic headlight. But look at the difference already. And that was just one quick pass. Wanna show them the other side, please? Guys, for the final, now that it's nice and done, it's nice and clear, we're gonna go ahead and protect it. First, I'm gonna do a surface prep with the eject. This is to remove any of the residue left over from the polish, from the compounds. You want to make sure that whatever you're going to use, whether it's a wax, a sealant, or a ceramic coating, it's going to bond with the surface. So this is going to prepare it just to get it ready for that ceramic coating. Very light mist. All you do, wipe it off. Now any kind of fingerprints, any kind of oil residue from your hands, any kind of polish, glazes, sealants, uh, compound residue is going to all be removed and now it's ready to take on the ceramic coating. For this one, I'm gonna do the actual ceramic coating. This is a one year spray ceramic coating. And you'll love it because it actually will last up to one year. Now, being that it's the headlights, being that our weather, uh, the weather out here is really, really hot, I wanna do this at least every six months. I wouldn't wait a whole year. 
let that sit and cure about six minutes, wipe it off, and you're done. Your headlights will be um, nice and clear. They'll be protected, ceramic coated. There you have it, guys. It's super simple to do. The whole kit is $24.99. Come and pick it up. 1549 Hillman Street, right behind the Tulare outlets, next to the big lots in Ross Dress for Less. Come and pick it up, guys.